Hello again. Welcome back to Staying Stainless with Linda. On today's edition, we'd like to discuss what has happened in the past, not too long ago. Sometime in April, uh, a very famous Nigerian dancer by the name of Cora Obidi and her husband, Justin Dean, were arguing on social media. The issue was, according to Justin, that his wife wanted celebrity status on social media. She's a dancer and he is a sports uh, coach. So the two gathered together, they met on Tinder, which is a social dating app in China, and they became friends. They wedded in 2017, and they've had two children since then. So the issue now is that Justin decided to tell us that his wife's quest to become a celebrity is what is causing the issue that's causing her, him and her to separate. So... This is what we think, honestly. Social media is a fantastic tool. It's a fantastic means of communication, but there are rules that you need to follow. So Staying Stillness with Linda, sponsored by St. Candid House, has a few tips. How to live a stainless life on social media, part one. Post sparingly, do not post every day, or post several times uh, a day or a week. Do not send a sarcastic tweet. Sleep over your statement on Twitter. Check it over and over again. Sleep over it. Think about it. Think about the reaction. Think about your family before you post. Therefore, post sparingly. Number two, obey Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, WhatsApp rules, and all the other social media. If you're going to be on a dating app, make sure you read their rules before you get into it. And if you meet someone on the dating app, be very, very respectful. Stay stainless. Leave your dirty linen in the laundry room inside your home. Do not spread your dirty linen in public. Then do not defame anyone. Get character defamation out of the way. Speak positive. Stay stainless. Leave your kids or children out of the social media. Even your pets. Do not put them on social media. Okay? So do not post nude photos of your spouse. I don't care how good he looks or how good, how great she looks. Leave nude photos out. Venge porn is real and that can get you in prison. Okay? Do not call your estranged spouse derogatory names just because you're no longer together on social media. Leave that out there. Remain classy with grace and finesse. Say the good things about that person. Leave the dirty linen in your laundry room, inside your recycle bin, or rather don't recycle it. Put it inside the laundry room and wash it with the laundry, okay? Do not release anyone's video without their consent. Seriously. Do please give credit to background music that you're using and or other educational informative articles or periodicals. Stop allowing social media to dictate how to live your life or how to control you. This is very, very important. So the reason I mentioned Cora, OBD, and Justin is the fact that since April, Justin Dean decided to say that he's going to sue his wife or he was going to sue her. Whether he sued her or not is not important. What's important is that social media can do more good than harm or can do more harm than good, depending on how you look at it. If you're going to enter a dating app such as Tinder or Match.com, make sure you are honest, keep your integrity intact. So once again, my name is Linda, and I am your host on Staying Stainless with Linda. To live a very stainless life on social media is our goal. So thank you for watching. Stay stainless. Subscribe to this show. If you like our programs, please be a subscriber and like us and stay stainless.